guess what today is? The last day of school! Woo! And we are going to celebrate by welcoming the kids into summer with a fun prank. Hi! <laughs> McCoy! And we're gonna reach out to you guys. I don't know if you're gonna be living in the states where we're hitting, but we definitely wanna do a meetup. <laughs> Have some pit hair. So here we are at the Leonardo. And then look. Here. Ah. This is the magic. Koi. Now you see me? Then the bottom of those. Whoa. Wait, where's William? So I will lay aside every sin which should easily beset me. I will trust my fear into his care to finally be free. Good morning, Dykes fam. It's a beautiful day outside. The sun is out, the birds are chirping, and the weather is beautiful. It's a fantastic day to be these kids' last day of school for the year. Ooh. Hey guys, yeah. you excited or what? Yeah, I'm excited and not excited. You're excited and not excited. Explain. Because um, I'm excited that school is over so that we can have summer break. Um, and my birthday's coming up. And I, the bad thing is, my teachers are so nice in second grade. It's the best. I love second grade. Yeah. And the reason is I like it is because my teacher is the best and she likes, she likes us watch movies in the classroom <laughs> and play games. Obviously the kids are going to be sad but they're also happy. I, You know, it's, it's just one of those things, it's a bittersweet moment. but. We're excited because then that means we get to spend a little bit more time together as a family. We don't have to do homework. Ooh, no homework. And no math test and no test. That's I mean, right. I like doing tests, math tests, and spelling tests, and homework. I'm glad that the kids have lived up to our motto this year, which is, uh, what is our motto? What does Dad always say to you? Be nice to everyone. And have you guys done that this year? Well, I hope you guys enjoy your last day of school. Okie dokie. Okie dokie. Give me hugs. Give me smooch. Give me hugs and a smooch. Love you, bud. You guys have a fantastic day, okay? Good. I love you. Be nice to everybody. Okay. Hey, guys. Guess what today is? The last day of school. Woo! And we are going to celebrate by welcoming the kids into summer with a fun prank. Right, Dad? They're gonna get super soaked. Um, it's only 56 <laughs> degrees outside. Right. I don't know what's going on this year, you guys, but it is so cold where we live. Like, normally we're at least in the 80s, but it is only 10 a.m. because the kids had a short day and they only went from 8 to 10. I don't know what the point of that was, but anyways, we are going to soak the kids with squirt guns and water balloons. <laughs> and what are you going to do to Tayden and Sis? Uh, right, what are you going to throw at him? Water balloons. William, say hi. Hi. Show them what you got. Hi. Hey guys. Show them what we got, buddy. Hold on. Don't tell them, but look, I've got my arsenal. Look at you. Those kids are going down. Into yeah, summer. yeah, 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 yeah. Christina is such a good sport. I was like, yeah, I don't know if I want to do this, but she's like, yes, we're going to do it. <laughs> I'm only slightly evil mother. Yeah. <laughs> Bye. Come on, Tate, get over here. Careful, appreciate this. 
Who wants it? McCoy. Regina, <laughs> go get Tayden. Go ahead, take that and go get Tayden. Go get Tayden. Get mom. Go get Tayden. Is it gone? Get him, Will. Dad, 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 no, not me, Jaden. No, 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 he already got me. Ah! How was that surprise? Good. Oh, you little. <laughs> get it. Yeah, get her. <laughs> Ah! This backfired on us. The only problem was is we ran out of water way too quick. Good idea, babe. Thanks. Happy summer. Happy summer, bro. Congratulations. McCoy, happy summer. Congratulations. School's out for summer. So, what'd you guys think about that little water surprise? That was awesome. Amazing. <laughs> Are we the coolest parents ever? Yeah. Oh, we are. Because you only let us do it if it's like 85 degrees and it's only 70 degrees. <laughs> <laughs> Mom, that was a heck of an idea. That was a school out success story. Yeah. So don't forget to prank your children when they get out of school. Guys, prank the ones you love, okay? That's always <laughs> been my motto. Next year is going to be even better. Right, babe? Oh, yes. We're planning already. Yes. We're coming for you guys. I can't don't, wait. don't forget. I can't wait. <laughs> oh, 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 I'm falling, so I'm taking my time on my ride. Right. Yeah, yeah. Oh, 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 I'm falling, so I'm taking my time. Hey, guess what? This leads into our next thing that we're going to be talking about, which is our ride. Taking our time on our RV ride. Oh, oh, That's the next big thing happening in the Dykes fam. So we're going to be leaving next week. So we're charting out our course today. We're going to get everything kind of figured out where we're going. And we're going to reach out to you guys. I don't know if you're going to be living in the states where we're hitting. But we definitely want to do a meet up somewhere along the road. Yep. So, so meet us. And we, we're going to probably need some, some ideas. Yeah. Whoever lives in the states. Australia? Yeah. We're going to Australia in an RV. So we might need some tips from you guys of some places that we should definitely check out uh, along the way. So, And hopefully we'll get to meet some of you guys. So stay tuned for that. So if you guys don't know this, I'm doing a weight loss program and it's really working. And so I like to rip my shirt off occasionally and go look in the mirror. And I did so and my kids are having some type of an issue. So it's not what you think though, it's because of this. <laughs> Does pit hair creep you out or what? Nikolai. Have some pit hair. William, does that creep you out? No. They're right. It does. It's gross looking. So I, <laughs> I definitely need to trim up my armpit hairs. It's hard to keep everything good when you're a hairy man sometimes. Someday, Tayden, you're going to have armpit hair just like your dad. Me too. 
<laughs> me you too. <laughs> yeah, buddy. Yeah, and Nicole, you are too. You're gonna have armpit hair just like your dad. I'm mom. <laughs> I'm mom too. Yeah, no, mom. mom doesn't have mom. armpit hair. Mom has lots of armpit no. hair. Looks like she's got buckwheat and headlock. <laughs> <laughs> you guys are so mean. Wow, it's been a long time since I've been vulnerable and intimate with uh, the YouTube viewers. But you guys may not know this. If you've been watching our vlogs, then you'll notice that I've lost some weight. I've lost about 28. Actually, I think I'm at 30 pounds weight loss now as of this morning. Yeah, I've lost 30 pounds in the last almost eight weeks. So I'm happy about that. Now I need to shave my beard and my armpit hair. Sorry if I grossed you guys out. We love you. Bye. You got your helmet on? Show me it. I think you might have it on uh, backwards, bro. Yeah. Don't worry, Dad. I'll help you. Oh. Well, you. <laughs> Goes this way. Like that, son. William has decided he wants to try to ride a bike with pedals. If you guys have seen him ride his Strider, he's awesome at balance. Oh, he's doing it. Oh, he's doing it. <gasps> You're even pedaling. Good job, guys! You got a pedal. Pedal, William! Pedal. Do the pedals! This is how I learned. Good job! How you going, buddy? That was our first attempt. Okay, William, was that fun? Yes, yeah, that helped me again. You want Dad to help you again? Yeah. Okay, hold on, Dad. Nikoi's outgrown this little princess bike. She's got a cute pink cruiser That's now. A big princess bike. You want to see? Yeah. Fast. I'm gonna send her for groceries with her basket. So we got all showered and ready because we are gonna go to this really cool museum called the Leonardo. Josh even decided that he didn't want to scare the people at the Leonardo with his scary armpits. <laughs> so he shaved them. <laughs> Don't worry guys, Daddy shaved his armpits. There's no longer a muskrat living in there. You wanna see? Dad'll have to show you. <laughs> When we get out, woo! Thank heavens, because that was a I'm little sexy bit man. <laughs> so we just wanted to talk to you guys a little bit about our road trip that's coming up in one, two, three, four, like four days by the time you guys see this. Oh my gosh, I am not ready. I have too much laundry to do and too much packing to do. We've never been to any of these places that we're gonna drive through, and so we don't know what there is to see, and you know, what places I need to eat at, what places my pregnant baby belly is going to wanna eat at. So, tentatively right now, we are planning to go through Idaho, Wyoming, Montana, South Dakota, Wisconsin, and Michigan. And then on the way home, we're going to be going through um, Illinois, Missouri, Nebraska, and Colorado, right? Or do we go through Wyoming? I don't know. Wait, is it Illinois or Illinois? Illinois. I don't know. You people from Chicago tell Chicago. me how to properly say that word, okay? So if any of you guys live in any of those states or you've been to any of those states, please name something that we need to go see and a place that we need to go eat while we're in that state. That would help us a lot because we're running out of days to plan this and we're kind of slacking on it. So we really need your help. So please give us some awesome suggestions on where we should take these cute kids. Hey guys. Hey guys Look at my shirt, William I'm, says. I'm are, you, the are you guys excited to go on the RV trip? Woo! Hey, I gotta say something real quick. Let's hear it. These kids have been praying every single night, thanking the Lord for this kind gentleman who's renting us his motor home and the fact that we get to go on this trip, they've been praying every night for it because they are so excited, aren't you guys? Yeah. yeah! Yes, they are. And so are we, and we're excited to bring you guys along. So please give us some great oh. suggestions on what you'd like to see us do while we're there. I got another suggestion. Let's hear it. If you guys live in one of those states that we're going to be going through, please let us know because if we do have some time, we would love to stop and do a meetup, but we don't even know where you guys live. Some of you guys live. A few of you from Michigan have said that, hey, yeah, we would love to see you. So we want to know if you're in any of those other states, we'd love to do a meetup. So let us know. Comments below. Comments below. Hello. And thumbs up. So here we are at the Leonardo. It's super awesome. Um, there is Leonardo here. 
the V Leonardo da Vinci. But this is a really cool art museum, but it is for all ages. So there's activities for little kids. Like you can build snowflakes over here and paper airplanes and build with these little straws and control the birdies. <laughs> Should we control the birdies? Watch me control these birds. Woo! I know that was amazing. But the kids are over here doing stop animation, making their own little movies. Tayden, are you gonna show us your movie? So you use these little people mm. and you put them on here and you take pictures of them. Yeah, watch. Um, and then look. Here. Ah, 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 ah. <laughs> Good movie, Tayden. Thanks. Okay, right. show me your movie. Oh no, the werewolf and the mummy. Oh, the tree. Oh, the cat jumped off the tree. They have a green screen. Watch this. Ooh, now you see me? Now you don't. Watch. This is the magic. And this is behind the scenes. But watch. Now you see me? Now you don't. This is the kids' very most favorite thing at this museum. Um, double escalator. And they just want to go up and down. Up and down. And up and down. All night long. Let's see McQuay. Okay. Don't you guys? Oh, cool. Oh, I have green. I, have I know you've got green. You look like you got holes in your and belly. No, you don't. Where's Koi? Koi. Now you see me? Now you don't. Now you see me? <laughs> You're a crazy girl. Josh is actually helping film um, an art contest thing that they're doing here. Um, some local artists came and they had a contest to see who could paint. They had like 45 minutes and Josh is filming that for his brother who works here. So it's going to be a fun night and we're having lots of fun, huh, Tayden? Riding the escalator over and over and over again. Oh, I love those. Whoa. Oh, yeah, Tayden, you are electricity. Okay, Nikoi, are you giving us a, so <laughs> a singing lesson? <laughs> This measures the frequency. Whoa, that was a crazy one. Ah. <laughs> well, you do you think that's funny? Whoa. Give that kid a microphone and he gets crazy. <laughs> Well, I guess we should just sleep here tonight, huh? It's already past your bedtime. Why don't you just sleep here? <laughs> Good night. The sleeping meditator. This place is really fun. Even mom's having fun building and doing art. What's creepy? Oh no, I don't want to go to the creepy. Wait, where are we? Which one's real? Okay, we gotta go through this maze. The maze of mirrors. Which one's the real me? Wait, where's William? Which one's William? There's so many Williams and so many good boys. I'm so confused. There. That is way too many of the Dykes fam. We're in trouble. There's four Williams. Tayden, watch out. Tayden, watch out. Okay, William, do that again. Go, go, give yourself high five again. Oh no, there's four Williams. We are in trouble. I can't handle one William. What are we gonna do with four? Ah, four Williams! Here he is, the man who brought us to this crazy place, Uncle Ben! What? Thanks for a great night, Ben. William had to show him. William well, had to show him the mirror room one more time because he thinks it's hilarious. Well, don't kick the mirror. Oh, yeah. your brother was just hey, like, I kept plugging it. felt so bad. There's dad. He's been having lots of fun doing all the kids yeah. stuff in the museum. And you're talking to some people. You haven't about been able to find him. So. Babe, you are looking hot. Oh, I don't know hot about stuff, that. babe. Daddy, Daddy. Did we have fun here tonight, you guys? Yeah. What do you guys tell Uncle Bench? Go give him a big fat hug. Oh. Thanks for coming to see me, guys. Everybody flex, and we'll do no one normally. He's been where I am before He will make all my weaknesses stronger And with his stripes I'll be healed from these bears Hoping by his side I'll stand I will run to the one who has grief